Alright, so this is a brief guide to acquire Ritualist archetype. Uh, the videos for acquiring it are that you'll find easily are inadequate because they're full of algorithmical bullshit and fillers and da 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 and they don't like really just show you like go here go here and actually show you they they love to point at the map which I'm gonna do some but it's just it's just bad so what you need is do a forlorn coast adventure this is the easiest way one shot if it's your first time uh, it'll load up all that so there's a lot of side dungeons and it's a very interconnected map this is where you'll start and when you come through here this is going to be locked there's going to be two ways you can go you can go under the sewer don't do that go up over the bridge you'll find a preacher guy he's preaching i'm sure you've seen it you just continue past him it'll take you through here and this will be locked as well but you will basically find your way this is all side area you'll go right up here and you'll find this big door it'll be sunken haunt um, I forget if it can be great sewers also or if that's a different part of the map it doesn't matter um, this will always be the same where I'm running my mouse through and you'll hit sunken haunt you'll come out here next to this stone drowned wren and you can come out and you can run basically when you come out of here there's this path which will be down a well there's like a graveyard and a well and some pigs uh, that's a different path you can end up in the same place uh, but there will always be a side dungeon down there as well you don't have to go down there you instead turn to your left when you come out and follow this around it'll be the upper paths and you will end up at this checkpoint and basically let's just show what that looks like actually that's that's the shortcut door rather than talking about it it's probably better to just show the show the direction yeah that's that's much more satisfying I think so you'll come out here you rest at the checkpoint, whatever. That's the graveyard and the pigs. Woo! Bypass them. Basically, I prefer go up these little stairs here to your left. What? Really? Where? Oh, whatever. Down through this arch. You'll come out here on the other side of that gate. Either direction will get you there. Keep going forward. Don't go down there. Look right here, you'll see the glow, etc. That's the checkpoint. Proceed through there. God, it still thinks I'm in combat? That was the wrong button. I'm used to that skill being the miasma. If you struggle with the enemies here, have some control pods ready to produce slow. Because obviously you don't have Ritualist yet if you're watching this guide. This is just survival difficulty, of course. So if you're just trying to get that, or...
gosh, that new stuff is ridiculous. Anyway, you cross the bridge, cross the bridge, and there's a couple different ways to get to it, but coming over here, that's a shortcut door, oops, down here, down this ladder, over, that's a, you can open that door, that's a side dungeon, come out through here, you're going to find the boat. And once you get the boats, that's what you're looking for, is this boat. Any of these boats, you can get onto them from there as well. See over here, you can get, as long, once you're on the boats, that's what you need. And any of these directions over there too, will pass on to them for you. So... You're not going to go there, you're going to look for this boat that goes under the dock. So on the map, it's these two little boats that are in an arch, and you go under the dock here. And I don't know if this save still is going to have the witch, but you're going to run under the docks, under this stone archway. And you're going to go right here. Okay, yeah, she's still here. So, you're going to sneak. Don't get her attention. Don't fire at her. Because you want her to summon this pig. It's going to turn into an abomination. And you're going to get... Oh, I, I went too soon. So, if you wait... She will turn the pig into an abomination and you'll get a mutator. So you want her to do that. So you need to wait. But once you kill her, you'll get... Once she dies, you will get the Ragged Poppet uh, item, which you can then craft. I, I can't get it because I've already gotten it, obviously. But that will allow you to craft the uh, Ritualist Engram. And that's it. Simple as that. And, uh, yeah, uh, praise, praise the gun. Where's the, where's that? There we go. Praise the gun. Jolly co-op. 